Every window nowadays that is properly installed that meets code called low E or low emissivity glass. Low emissivity glass is a glass that has a tint on it and it reflects heat to its source. So in the summer it's reflecting the heat out and the winter it's reflecting the heat in. And it is a code in most municipalities now that you have to have low E on your windows. And then uh, tempered glass, tempered glass is safety glass and I should explain that better. Tempered glass has been brought up to a higher temperature. That's why it's called tempered. And it changes the construction of the molecular construction of the window so that instead of breaking into great big shards like regular glass, it breaks into 10,000 little bitty pieces. But also it's stronger. It takes more abuse before it breaks. The reason why you have tempered glass is there's building codes. So like if you have a window in your bathroom or your shower, the, the glass is tempered, or it's supposed to be tempered is how I should say that, uh, by code. And the reason why is you're more prone to slip and fall in the shower or in the tub. And if your hand hits a regular window and it breaks into big shards of glass, they could potentially be you know fatal or mortally wound you, know, get, cut you severe. If you bust tempered glass, it breaks into 10,000 little bitty shards. You might get scra scratches and abrasions and things like that, but it's not going to kill you. And so, and the same thing uh, in stairwells, you have to have tempered glass. Again, you're going up and down stairs, you're more prone to trip or fall. So if you fall through the window, if it's regular glass, it could kill you. If it's tempered glass, it's, it's going to scratch you. It's not going, because it's gonna break into 10,000 little bitty pieces. But also again, it's more durable. It might not even break, it takes more abuse. And then lastly, when you have great big picture windows in homes, and the, the code is, if the glass is within 18 inches of the floor and it's over nine square feet of continuous glass, it has to be tempered. And that's because just using as an example, when you go into like a lot of homes, their back living room has big picture windows that are like ceiling to floor. Well, if you have a toddler that's riding a tricycle through there or something like that, and he rides the trike into the uh, glass and it breaks, well, big shards of glass could kill or seriously harm the child. But if it breaks into 10,000 little bitty pieces, he's gonna get scratches, but he's gonna walk away all right. And so that's the, that's the difference between tempered glass and low E glass. One's an efficiency thing, one's a safety thing.